Some people in Orange are furious about a park they say would bring back memories of a time in our nation's history when blacks were slaves and treated as second class citizens. A proposal for a Confederate Memorial Park off of Byington and Orange is drawing questions and concern from city leaders and citizens. KFTM reporter Leslie Rangel is investigating. She joins us now in the studio with more. Leslie. Since the end of the Civil War, personal and official use of the Confederate flag and flags stemming from it has continued, but not without controversy. Now, a private landowner in Orange wants to create a Confederate Memorial Park at the corner of Interstate 10 and MLK in Orange. People unhappy with the idea delivered their message to the City Council in Orange this morning. They say a Confederate memorial would send the wrong message to people driving through Orange. The piece of land for the proposed memorial is about half an acre, just off Interstate 10. Opponents say the memorial would cause racial tension and racial division. City Attorney Jack Smith says there isn't much the City Council can do. Smith says the issue is a matter of free speech and the First Amendment. He hopes the community protests prompt the landowner to drop the idea. It's just like the Ku Klux Klan has a right to demonstrate and have a parade. You may not like them, but they still have a right to do that. And what upsets me and I think a lot of other people is they'll get a wrong impression about our town by driving down Interstate 10 and seeing this and say, oh boy, look at this town, but this is an orange. The city attorney told citizens the city will do anything to help put a stop to the memorial. He says anyone concerned should protest, speak out against it, and even buy billboard space to counter the landowner. Reporting live in the studio, Leslie Rangel, KFDM 6 News.